President Aquino is firm on the rebidding of the multi-billion peso Cavite, Cavite Laguna Expressway or Calax project. This despite negative reactions from the business sector. The president maintained that the 8.4 billion peso difference in the offer of the winning bidder and the disqualified company is significant, saying the amount could be used to fund the construction of government infrastructure, such as socialized housing. He added that he would rather take criticisms from the investors than be blamed by the people. We are obligated to get the best deal for our people. When the allegation na inanalong bid was uh, uh, para outbidded by a bid that was disqualified. Okay. So, tapos medyo, tingnan, yung mga points, no? Kung magte-technical tayo, uh, kulang na four days yung bid document o yung bid security. Tinanong ko sa economic cluster, magkano ba actually binabayad mo just sa four days na yan to the bank that issues the, the bond, in effect, no? Eh, multi-billion to, Ang halaga raw ng 4 days na yun, thousands eh. Parang konting thousands. It's a percent, one-digit percentage of the of the, the security. Project is, ano yun, inalok ng isa, sabi nila, 20 billion. So, di, maski na at 20 billion, magkano lang yung... So, first page, maraming mga issue eh. First page, sinabi 180 days. Second page, naging 176 of so, kinumpute. May opinion yung consultants, legal consultants sa DPWH na i-clarify nyo, clarify ng banko, ng kumpanya, pero disqualify pa rin. Right. So, the, ang difference, may 11-something na bid at meron 20-something yeah. allegedly na bid. Formal yung 11. Na-violate nung C20 yung procedures na dapat sealed. 